bad. Uh, so I hear that uh, Mr. Houghton's on his way over. Maybe we could all have lunch before you head off. Well, that's a splendid idea. Nah, game starts in 45 minutes. Well, then perhaps he could come by after the game for a drink. Nah, sorry, that won't work either. He's got to go to his publisher's, drop off his new book. <laughs> Houghton has a new book? I've lost the feeling in my legs. <laughs> Well, did he say anything about it? I mean, the, the characters, the setting? No, I just said it was a book. Dad, you have to skip the game. It's not just for our benefit. After all this baseball, the man must be starved for intellectual stimulation. Oh, I know what you're saying. That someone like Dad would have to prefer to spend time with you instead of some dumbbell like me. Dad, you're not dumb. You missed the point entirely. <laughs> Frazier, the problem is you push too hard. We just... Talk sports, have a few laughs, that's all. You know, I never asked him about his work. That's probably why he told me about the book. Mr. Houghton. Hello. Hi, how you doing? Hey, Ted, come on in. How are you? So, you two boys are off to the baseball game, huh? Doubleheader. <laughs> that's two games. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Little known fact about baseball, uh, the owner of the Boston Red Sox sold Babe Ruth to the New York Yankees to finance a Broadway musical, No No Nanette. You ready, Marty? Let's go. <sighs> Frazier? Yes? Have you noticed how Houghton always carries a satchel with him wherever he goes? Well, actually, as a matter of fact, I have, yes. And didn't Dad mention that Houghton was on his way to his publishers after the game with the new manuscript? Yes. And wouldn't that be the very same satchel which is now resting under my head? <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> Wait! Should we? We shouldn't. Could we live with ourselves if we did? Could we live with ourselves if we didn't? Could we live with ourselves either way? Oh, stop it, now! <laughs> oh, who are we kidding? All right. Chameleon Song by T. H. Houghton. Oh, these are handwritten corrections. Frazier, this is his original manuscript. Shame on you. <laughs> Going through someone else's personal property. Well, it's just plain wrong, and I know your father wouldn't approve. Of course, I wouldn't be here to tell him if I had the day off. Fine, go. Great. <laughs> Frazier has left the building.